Like they say, politics is a very dirty game. Imagine this group coming out in broad daylight to say to Tinubu that we supported you, we stole money to support your election, so please give us board appointments. <laughs> As you all know, Tinubu dissolved all board, you know, across all ministries and parastators, all board members have been dissolved and a position or a post of about 2,000 is now vacant you know, for APC loyalists to occupy as usual. So this group has come out, you know, to beg for board appointment, all because they supported Tenobo during the campaign period. You know, politics is a game of, you know, rub my back, I rub your back. You know, all those news that you hear that, oh, I gave, uh, just for example, Apabio, who's, Wiki who said that Apabio gave him 200 million naira when he wanted you know, to vie for the position of a governorship. That was why he also supported him in return for the Senate presidency ticket. So it's just, you know, do me a favor now. I will return the favor in the next in the next year or next time that I'm able to. That is how politics run. You know, you hear news of uh, this person gave me so so amount of money. This person did that. No before mouth too. <laughs> no before mouth is like an investment. Rub my back, I rub your back. Do me a favor now, I'll refund the favor. That is how it is. So, you guys, before we go into the details of today's news, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do well to subscribe. Turn on the post notification bell so that you can be the first person to get notified whenever we upload a new video. Help us grow this channel as well by giving this video a massive thumbs up so that it gets recommended to other YouTube viewers all around the world as well. Lastly, leave your opinions. In the comments section below without further ado let's delve right into the details of today's news we stole money to support your election give us board appointments support group tells tenobo for somebody to be able to stay boldly that they stole money and they are not even if they are, it's not like they are speaking from the prisoner you know? they are free running free and they are saying boldly that they stole government money money meant for the the the, uh, the nigerian citizen they stole it to support an election hmm. it don't happen over this country an amalgamation of support groups across nigerians 36 states under the aegis of g36 renewed hope support group has called on president tinobo to compensate them with board appointments to underscore underscore their frustration the support groups and their members stole and borrowed money to oil the campaign wheels of Mr. Tinobu. Your Excellency, you are a grassroots politician, so you are aware of all we must have passed through during the election. Many of our support groups borrowed, begged, indirectly stole, and sold our properties to ensure victory for you at the poll. That stated the groups in lagos on wednesday at a press conference on this note we are speaking in one voice appealing to you that we deserve to be compensated the group's leader sam sin bill billy Sumi, noted that we know we cannot all be your ministers special assistants or chief of staff but you can appoint us into federal boards and agencies which are over 200 in number. It will further to it's it went further. Pardon me, to call the president's attention to how the earlier amalgamated group support groups disappointed him, urging Mr. President to disband them. Your Excellency should dissolve the amalgamated and replace it with another one, stated Billy Sumi. This is because. Anything given under that umbrella should be cornered by few individuals, pardon me, would be cornered by few individuals who could not account for millions given to us during the campaign. An amalgamation of support groups across Nigerian's 36 states under the aegis of G36 Renewed Hope Support Group has called on President Bola Tinubu to compensate them with board appointments. You can imagine these people are begging <laughs> beggars in politics so now wow 
is now is, the fact is they did not only beg they also said that you know that other group that you also gave money like you gave to us to campaign for you during the campaign period that group that embezzled the money you gave to them that group that did not use the money to actually campaign for you disband them and you know give us an appointment they are fighting for themselves so <laughs> They are fighting seriously hard for these appointments. They are fighting really bad. Do you guys, do you know how many people that would have even... People are fighting already for these ministerial slots. They are fighting already for, for board members, federal board members and agency board. They are fighting. It's, it's, it's really sad, though. It's really sad. Like, I was having a discussion, like, was it yesterday or the day before yesterday? Like, no person that can help you in this country, even if you carry first class and you print it on your head like this, carrying it about, it's really hard to find people that want to, you know, go with merits these days. People instead want to go with, or oh, who do you know? Or people want to return favor that has been done to them by giving jobs to, you know, family members and relatives, whereas people who actually qualify for that position are out and about looking for jobs to no avail without results that is that is what the country has turned into it is you know who no person gets the most advantage in this country before i go let's take a look at some of the reactions from online A key mini says, no shame to tell the world that you stole money to support somebody. Wait until investigation proves you innocent before you could be given an appointment. Abio, you, you stole money and you are telling the whole world that, oh, we stole money to campaign for you. Imagine. <laughs> Nigeria, don't suffer. Olaya says, imagine what else remains. All these thieves are looking for national cake. This is APC system of government, Momo country, with wicked citizens who desires bad leadership for selfish reasons, tribal group, marginal. Taiwo Sam says, some people are crazy with choice of words and sentences when debating their rights. <laughs> this is more than crazy. Look at this. The group said they, that they stole money. One needs to ask them, did Jagaban told you to go to steal. You aren't normal. This they are not normal, lo. Hmm. Another person by the name Matthias says this group have has confessed and declared that they committed criminal actions to ensure Bolatinobu got victory. And so it is clear that the group deserves prison sentence without trials. <laughs> and Tinobu, Tibola Tinubu victory be nullified. If Nigeria is a serious nation at the M, at the M to fight corruption, hmm. and it, was, it meant to say, uh, and the aim to fight corruption, um, as you know, if it were to be in other Sena countries or Sena climes, but they will by now be, you know, persecuting even Tinubu himself who collected the money. You know, who collected, him, he collected money from people who stole funds to support him. But we are in Nigeria now. Everything goes. Yo, let me have your thoughts in the comment section. What do you think about this? Subscribe if you haven't. Give this video a massive thumbs up. I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.